Working with subjects who wear glasses can definitely present quite a challenge when it comes to glass glare. Stick with us in this episode of Photography 180. I'm going to show you how one of Evoto AI's game-changing new features just might be able to save the day for you. Now I want to start off this episode by saying that it is most important to learn how to set up your lights properly in order to photograph a subject who does wear glasses. There's a, there's a definite science to it. It's all about angles and uh, light positioning. It's very important. And you can achieve a clean headshot without glass glare straight out of camera and that's what you should be pushing for. However, in certain situations you might be rushing, you might be short on time, you might be struggling a little bit. It's okay. I think in these situations it's okay to leverage something like Evoto AI and especially this brand new feature that they've come out with to kind of remove that glass glare um, and of course focus long term on learning how to properly light straight out of camera without getting the glare. But let's get right into it. Let's shoot a couple shots of Maria. We'll bring it right into Evoto and show you just how easy it is to be able to remove that glare. Okay, so I have Maria here and we're gonna just do a couple quick shots and then like I said, jump right into Evoto. Um, so you can see we're using a, a two light setup here. This is the Explore uh, 600 in a 42 Magbox Pro. In the back, I have a Flashpoint 100 Pro with a MagMod uh, sphere and grid, just giving a little accent to the background. And the front here is my Bowflector from Cheetah Stand uh, with the gold side. So get a nice little uh, catch light in the eye, subtle, um, and also some lift in shadows. So Maria's gonna face me, uh, chin this way just a bit. We're getting, I can see it right in camera before I shoot it. We're gonna get uh, glare and you're gonna see the image here on the screen. But obviously we don't want those reflections to overpower the eyes. We wanna be able to have that nice and clear. In another video, I'll do a follow up on how to properly adjust your lighting so that you can still get the results you want without the glare coming out of camera. Um, but in this case, let's jump right into Evoto AI. I'll show you how just a quick slider in their newest, like I said, game changing feature. Uh, can definitely save the day for you in a pinch for sure. So it's a great new feature. Let's uh, show you what it looks like. Okay, so here we are in Evoto AI and I've brought in all images. I have 14 images here uh, that we shot all together. Um, and as you can see in each one, as we run through, we've got some form of glare showing up in each and every one. Um, so I'm only gonna focus on one image here. I have a preset that I apply for normal retouching in Evoto. So I'm gonna let that run uh, against Maria, but we still see that uh, the glare is in the glasses. That's not part of my preset here. So here in this section here, we have glasses glare. Uh, again, it is a beta feature, but as you can see, as I run the slider up, I'll go all the way up to almost full power here. And oh man, just look at that. How, how crazy is that? I can run a sync against all these images. It'll just apply my preset along with the glass glare removal. And as you can see, I run through each of these images in real time. It's applying that preset. Uh, you can just see the power of this and the fact that it's just in beta and still gonna get better and improve. It's, it's absolutely incredible. And so check it out. It'll definitely uh, you know, rescue you when you get stuck in a, in a, in a tough spot and you, and you just can't seem to get the glare out of the glasses in camera. So highly recommend it. You can uh, look at the link in the description and earn a couple of free credits to try it out. Hope this episode has been helpful, guys. And I look forward to uh, seeing you all again next week on Photography 180.